All right, people, this is Brad the Lab back again with another video. This is my Man United against Newcastle preview. Now, first of all, before I get into this preview, I want to apologise for not doing any videos because I've had a lot of problems. There's been people asking me, not, not all of you, but there's been one or two people asking me why I haven't been uploading. Uh, and the reason is, is because I've been having a lot of problems on my data and my iPad could have broke. So, um... And this channel might not have not existed anymore. I would have had to create a new account, and that would have been difficult because I've been have to go back to square one. And why and how far I've come would be absolutely heartbreaking um, because of what I've achieved. So the channel goes on. We managed to find it. We found a miracle. We found a way, and we found the channel. So everything is good. So I'm going to do two videos today. And I'll do one tomorrow about my anxiety journey because I've done that in a while. And I'm gonna, you know, I've, I'm, you know, and we're gonna talk about that. So let's talk about this game. So, yeah, unfortunately, I couldn't do anything about the Watford preview and the Watford review. It was a shower of shite, wasn't it? Um, two 0 defeat against the team bottom of the Premier League. Watford played really, really well. To be fair to them, I think Nigel Pearson will drag them out of the relegation zone. I think. You know, he's got, he knows what he's doing. He's done it with Leicester City before. So why can't he do it with Watford? Um, and I think going into this game against Newcastle, we need to improve. We want to, you know, I'd love a, a, love, a late Christmas present from Man United. And that is three points against Newcastle. And I think, you know, we've had some good games against Newcastle, particularly Old Trafford. We lost at St. James's Park back in October to a, a Matty Longstaff goal. There's a FIFA game going on in behind here. Um, and obviously, we've seen, um, you know, some really interesting games. We played them on Boxing Day a couple of times. We played in 2012 and won 4 3. Um, we had to come back a couple of times as well. Um, we also won 3 1 against Newcastle in 2014 15 season on Boxing Day, winning 3 1, and we won 3 2 last season. This wasn't on Boxing Day. One of my favourite games of the season Manchester United 3, Newcastle 2. We were 2 0 down. Jose was under a lot of pressure. We came back and won the game in dramatic style. Um, I couldn't unfortunately watch the game live on that day. I don't know why. I think there was something wrong with the, the, the TV or the box, whatever. But I remember. It was 2 0. I was like, oh, you know, this is just going to be another depressing weekend. And then I found out, oh my God, it's 2 2. And then we found out we were winning. So, yeah, it was, a, it was mad. I watched it match the day later. It was amazing. So, Newcastle at home. I think, you know, it's going to be a tough game. Steve Bruce returns to Old Trafford. He beat United back in October. Let's hope it doesn't happen again. Newcastle are in good form at the moment. And I think, you know, we don't do well against the teams down below and you know I expected Newcastle to be bottom of the Premier League and the level on points of those and could go above us so what 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 do you say about that Steve Bruce has done an absolutely sensational job uh Almiron got his first goal for Newcastle against Palace at the weekend that will do him a lot of uh, give him a lot of confidence and I think you know for United we've got to be on top of our game we've got to play we've got to treat Newcastle, like it's City or Spurs. If that's what it's going to take for us to win games, then you've got to play like that. I feel we are going to be underdogs, and I actually feel that Newcastle are going to win the game, unfortunately. I'd love to say United are going to win, but, you know, unless Ole Gunnar Solskjaer can do something about it, I think, you know, um, United are going to have to do you know, a lot of work. It's going to be very difficult. It's going to be a tight game. I think Newcastle will make it very hard. They'll be without St. Maximum, which is a positive for us. Paul Popper's back. Hopefully, he can start. And hopefully, you know, he was a bit of a creative spark in the match against Watford. He did change things a bit. I thought Martial played okay in that one. So, let's hope how it... Let's see how it goes. So, guys, that is going to be my Man United against Newcastle preview. I'm going to do the Phil Neville training session today instead of Wednesday. Because it's Christmas Day. Don't want to be stopping your day and thinking, Oh, Brad's done a video, you know. I wouldn't have cared if you didn't do it, if you didn't watch it. You know, it's Christmas Day. I don't expect you to. I just want to upload it because <laughs> it's that's just how Brad likes to do things. So, guys, I'll see you all later. Have a fantastic day, and I'll see you in a moment for the Phil Neville uh, training session.
and it's with Middlesbrough today. Have a great day.